Well, Justin, uh, a point, is that a fair result, do you think? Possibly, I think, um, I think we're again delighted with, with the point on the road. Uh, very solid performance, I'd rather say, than spectacular. Um, but, you know, I think we'll uh, come to you know, uh, a big club, the uh, one that we, we look up to, and um, I think we were you know, certainly worthy of the point, but whether or not we've done enough time in there, I wouldn't think we did. And like where defences were on top of both ends, do you think? Yeah, I think, you know, Lenny made a very good save in the first half. Other than that, you know, he, he wasn't tested. But I thought we, we huffed and puffed and just had a little final ball. And another day, you know, Zeb's, you know, had a little bit of an air shot of one. And we got in some good positions that probably just didn't, uh, you know, make the right decision and with the final ball. Putting away from home, though, in a clean sheet, a lot to be proud of in your first season back in the Football League. We are. And I think, like I said, coming to sort of a place... And a team like Plymouth, who, who not long ago were, were in the championship. Um, you know, it's the big occasions for for, my, for the club, for myself, and the, and the players. So you know, we go away with a with a head held high. An off the field incident to talk about with about ten minutes left, and the floodlights went out. Was there ever a danger that the game might not finish? Well, I, I, I perhaps still felt that we could have played on, you know, but um, you know, it's the ref's decision. But you know, they, they were. You know, pretty adamant that there was a good lights are always going to come back on, so I think it was, uh, it was never in a doubt. And their bench was in agreement as well that the game should carry on? Yeah, I don't, I don't think there was any, any problem there. Christian Jolly back on the bench tonight. Is he in mind for a bit of football on Saturday? Is that the big return in your mind? Yeah, I think, you know, we, we, we brought him here. He trained yesterday. Um, you know, he's fit to go now, so a uh, couple more days training is going to, you know, prolong and hurt us, sorry. Enhancing ready for, for, for match minutes, and uh, you know, hopefully, we'll, we'll give him some on Saturday. And how big a boost is it to have him back in and around the group? Because you've got so many injuries at the moment. I think more reason for me doing it today is to give, give the group a lift, and the supporters as well, everyone involved in the football club, and, and more so for Christians. So, yeah, that no, was a big lift. Any light at the end of the tunnel with any of the others? Yeah, we're getting there slowly. Um, I think that uh, Andrew Hughes hopefully will be fit for, for Saturday. And, um, possibly Ryan Burge, who's just taken a little bit longer than we hoped, but they're, they're certainly progressing now. And um, Aaron O'Connor had his uh, operation last night, and uh, that was successful. So, you know, we're making good progress. And then, testament then, given the names you've mentioned there, to the players who are playing, playing out of position, how well are you doing at the moment? You, you're up a place tonight, tonight. I've said it all along, I think we've been fantastic. I think we've, we've the players have been amazing. I think they deserve. Uh, a lot, a lot of credit. I don't think any other club in this league would have been out of cope. And I think that's the volume of the players that have come in. We have had nine players missing in one in any one time. Now I'm talking about nine of them players should be first team. So uh, I think it's been a fantastic effort from everyone involved in the football club. Hopefully, you look on that front. Will change soon. Well, we'll. You know, I, I really feel that you know when January comes, then we're going to have something like five or six new signings, and they're going to be ones that are ready at the club. So yeah, we look forward to that. Well done tonight. Thank you very much. Big night for Ellis Redden as well. Is he someone who's going to be involved in the, in the future? Yeah, I think um, you know he's he's come with us pre-season. He's done very very well. We've monitored the development in the youth, and um, you know I, I would never ever put anyone on there if I didn't feel that they were able uh, to play. And uh, he's only on merit. And it's another. You know, another player that we've had come through the youth system that's you know in and around it now. So you know, that's credit to the youth team and uh, Ian and John and, and young Dan that you know they continue to, to produce the players. So I'm, I'm delighted for, for everyone involved, you know, with the youth. That, you know, we're able to, to continue the development of the youngsters and bring them through. Yeah. Any other youngsters likely to, to make? No, not at the moment. No, I think you know I've always said there's no point in putting anyone on there just to make up the numbers. They've got to be good enough. Um, so at the minute, I think Ellis is the only one right now. How long is uh, Harry like to get? Uh, probably two weeks, so yeah, another week from, from Saturday.